totally love the products. They're amazing. Hello, hello. So tonight I decided that um, I was actually going to try out some new products. Um, I have been trying to figure out the kind of roller set and products that work best for me. Um, lately, what I have been using has been um, Lotta Body as far as my setting lotion or spray, whatever you want to call it. And I don't have anything against it, but I have been um, noticing that my hair is getting really dry um, and brittle, and that's even if I do it only like twice a week. <laughs> um, so I wanted to try and find something else. They did order um, some stuff from Suavecito that's actually um, for setting your hair with rollers, along with a couple other things because I was out anyway, so why not get new things? So yes, I paid for these. It's not a promotion. They don't know I exist. But I thought I would show you how it came. I always like it when there's really cool packaging like this to keep everything in. This is the Firm Hold Hairspray. Um, I have spent more and I have spent less on hairspray. This was, I believe, $14.99. I've spent $20 and $25 on really nice hairspray. And I've also spent like next to nothing, you know, on the super cheap stuff. Um, but what I like is that um, it claims that it is all day humidity resistant, volumizing, and has coconut oil in it. And I, and this is actually one of the reasons why I decided to buy more products from the company is because look at that lovely nail, sexy. But um, it really is because of this information right here. I, I wanted all that. I wanted clean, nice products. And I really liked that it said, this said that has coconut oil in it so it can not dry out my hair um, as much, hopefully. And I'm really curious about the humidity resistant because, wow, I live in Virginia. <laughs> It gets humid here. So I'm interested in trying this. Um, I've used a lot of dry shampoos before. Typically I get a spray. This is a powder um, with like a shake spout. I've seen them use it in videos, but it has like this little um, spout, like a seasoning kind of pack and you're just supposed to tap it into your hair. Um, so I'm really curious about that. This was $6. I will make sure I'm right about what I said. So $5.99 as far as I remember and then this is their grooming spray it's actually the one that's recommended for setting curlers um, i'm actually going to try it out tonight and do a video and see what happens and um i believe this was 8.99 this is the only one i don't remember as much but total for the bill it was 24 and change um so really not a bad deal for getting three products that are definitely nicer products. It's not the cheap stuff and that are super clean and cruelty free and all that good jazz. Um, and basically their intent is, you know, to make it for people who are doing these kinds of looks with their hair. So I'm super excited to try it. Um, and I will include um, with the rest of this video, what it feels like and some commentary on the setting process itself. So see you later. All right, so let's get started. Let's go ahead and see how the Suavecito grooming spray compares to the Lotta Body that I've been using. It doesn't feel as crispy crunchy, which I really like. It means it should theoretically be easier to brush out in a lot of ways, because that's one of the things I don't like about Lotta Body is that, you know, whenever I go to brush out my hair, I am like really struggling more than normal because it's so crunchy. Luxurious. <laughs> like I can't even like ugh. Like it really made I haven't even teased my hair yet. Like that's awesome. Super soft. 
but nice curl. It's not super crunchy. I didn't have like pieces of my hair crumbling all over me. It was so great. So, 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 so great.